what your body gotta do. What? Hey, what's up guys? It's Simu here back with a video. Welcome back to a brand new video on the channel. Today guys, we are going to take a look at how to make your very own face cam border. So, it's a really cool way to make your face cam look very much cool. And without taking any longer, let's really get started. So, first thing, go ahead to the link which is going to be down in the description below. And see the full tutorial on how to get this application which card I do before a shop touch. So, I have already done a tutorial on how to make it, how to get it for free. So, go ahead and get it for free and open it up. Once you guys done that, you go ahead and hit on that uh, button button with over there and create a brand new blank document but before you do that make sure that you go ahead and change the resolution to 1280 x 720 and here you go once you guys done that what you can do is you're gonna go ahead and hit on that uh, layers button and create a brand new MT layer so go ahead and create a brand new MT layer once you guys done that go ahead and hit on that uh, like end button with over there and once you guys done that you go ahead and hit on fill and stroke and now it's going to give you something like that now once you guys done that go ahead and hit, hit on the check mark button and now go ahead and hit on that end button and hit on transform and transform it to the middle and make sure that you let a little space between our layer and the edge of the project or the document okay once you guys done that uh, what you can do is you can go ahead and make sure that it is on, on the middle and hit on the check mark button and now hit on that uh, button on the left and hit on select pixels so it is going to be like select the layer and once you guys done that go ahead and create a brand new empty layer same as we have done with the first uh, like uh, step so once you guys done that go ahead and hit on that end button and hit on fill and stroke but this time make sure that you go ahead to type and change it from uh, fill to stroke and now you will have the same thing so in order to change it go ahead and to, to color and change it to black and also now what you can do is you can go ahead and make uh, sure that you make it uh, like uh, thicker as you can see and now we, we have our face cam border as actually done but it's actually pretty much boring it doesn't have that much design so we are going to add a design to it so make sure that you are on the square selection tool now once you guys done that go ahead and hit on that mod plus button it still it says plus and go ahead and select this area right over here then hit on that end button and go to fill and stroke and hit on that check mark button right over there and once you guys done that what you're gonna do is you're gonna go ahead and warp it from the edges so let's go ahead and just warp it from here so we will change the shape for it now it's having when you perfect shape as you can see now the next step what you can do you can go ahead and do whatever you want with it I honestly don't know just make sure that you'll be creative for example I'm gonna head and transform it and make it as you can see here bigger so that looks pretty much cool and now let's go ahead and add another one of those designs so let's go ahead and make sure that we duplicate the layer and maybe we will transform it and make it right over here and guys you are not stuck with this design you just be creative and make whatever you want as I told you before so let's go ahead and maybe change the color so and let's see what we will have at the end so that looks pretty much ugly let's go ahead and make it below the black layer and let's go ahead and add a stroke and uh, let's go ahead and change the color and make it thicker and yep that looks pretty much cool as you can see right over here guys now we are done with the face border now the next step what you can do is you're gonna go ahead and add some text right over there so i'll be right back when i'm done and as you can see right over here guys i just uh, add subscribe and like which pretty much looks pretty much nice and you can go ahead and add different stuff like i don't know follow or leave comments just be creative and do whatever you want now the next step go ahead and hit on that layers button and go ahead and delete our first layer that we have created by pressing on that button right over there so once you guys done that what you're gonna do is you're gonna go ahead and go to the top uh, left corner and hit on that down button right over there so once you press on it it's going to pop this brand new window hit on save and if should be saved it straight away and now what you can do is you're gonna go ahead and hit on that share button then hit on the save to gallery and make sure that you switch the two from gpeg to png then hit on that button right over there uh, hit on that uh, sorry uh, like uh, project that we was creating and hit on ok and it should be saved so okay guys once you guys done that what you can do is you're gonna go ahead to your own video editor i'm using kind master which is a really awesome video editor which you will find a link in the description below so you can go ahead and download kind master for free but if kind master does not work for your android device what you can do is you're gonna go ahead and download viva video or power director they are cool video editors as well and they can do the trick so once you guys done that go ahead and download your own video editor that works for your device and import wherever video that have a face cam so i have already done that before as you can see right over 
over here now next step go ahead and add a brand new image layer and just add the image that we were working on photoshop touch by going to the for adobe photoshop touch for uh, folder right over here and just go ahead and choose the face cam border that we was working on and go ahead and adjust it by transform it and make sure that it's uh, it have the same size with the, your uh, like uh, face cam and as you can see right over here it's actually done we have now a brand new design to our face cam so that looks pretty much cool and i have seen so many youtuber uh, youtubers have done uh, like uh, this face cam border thing and it makes them videos look pretty much cool and if you are doing a face cam video that's a really cool trick so make sure that you go ahead and try it out so you guys uh, that's a part for this video i really hope you guys enjoyed this video if you did please give this video a big thumbs up that means a lot for me and also guys make sure you check my channel out because there is a lot of amazing and daily videos in there subscribe for more and i'll see you guys tomorrow till then peace out guys